Hi again, everybody. TV3 Meteorology. Bill Vesey here. Let's take a look at what's going on across the country. Let's start in Salt Lake City, Utah, where the snow is continuing to fall. Last couple of days, we've uh, centered on the East Coast with the big nor'easter there, the big snowstorm. Let's go back west. And one of the reasons we show you the pictures from Salt Lake is because this is behind a cold front, the same cold front that's headed this way and will be here early on Friday morning. So there's the front right now, right on the Utah-Colorado border, right going through the uh, Four Corners area. And we'll be in Texas tomorrow and here after midnight early on Friday morning. Lots of sunshine in South Texas today. Rainfall, we check it every Wednesday here on TV3. Nothing today. Month is three days old. For the year, a little less than an inch and a half. We're about a third of an inch below normal. And there is some rain in the forecast. The question is how much? Probably not a lot. But uh, at least a little bit is better than the zero we've been dealing with. The past couple of days. All right, a live picture from the Lexcan, the beautiful bayfront. 72 right now after a high of 76. Look at the winds, up to 23 sustained. So breezy out there right now, and the pressure on the way up from 29.94. Here are the current temperatures, ranging from 69 at Ingleside, 77 at Falfuria, 78 Hebronville, 76 in Robstown and Alice. So we're looking at a breezy evening. All right, partly cloudy skies by morning. In fact, we'll probably have partly cloudy this evening overnight through tomorrow morning. And then during the day tomorrow, going to be another nice day with sunny to partly cloudy, days, but it's going to be breezy. So the breeze will continue tomorrow in anticipation of that next front head of this way. And again, that front will be here after midnight tomorrow night, early Friday morning. And there's a slight possibility there's a little bit of rain along and ahead of the front. Most of that would probably occur or shower if it did happen. And then during the day on Friday, another nice day with lots of sunshine, mostly sunny, will be the forecast for Friday. We have another cold front. Head of this way, this would be number two. It'll be another dry front. It'll be here on Sunday. And then a real interesting front setting up to get here a week from today. And this one's going to be pretty potent. In fact, some of us could freeze next Thursday morning. So there's some warning for you. We'll keep an eye on it. A lot of time between now and then. And again, the rain chances start ramping up next week. And again, late next week, could be interesting. So we'll continue to keep an eye on that. Winter's not over yet. Groundhog said it yesterday. Lows in the morning, 59 here in Corpus Christi. In fact, the temperature range tomorrow, only 58. Well, there's a 53 in Rock, so 53 in Rockport to 64 in Port Aransas. So then the time cast for tomorrow, sunny to partly cloudy, breezy and warm. A high temperature, 83. The record high is 88. Some of us could come Close to setting a record tomorrow, but look at all those 80s on the map for tomorrow. Water temperature 63. Caution for the bays, small craft advisory for the Gulf. Sun up a quarter after seven. Two high tides tomorrow, just before noon and right around this time tomorrow. Seven day forecast, significantly cooler next week. 42 on Wednesday morning. We could be in the mid to low 30s next Thursday morning. And update at 6, back to you.